The days of chandeliers only belonging in the dining room is long gone. Shed the light. They are everywhere. They are in our kitchens, our bedrooms, our closets, and even our laundry rooms. But if you had your chandelier for a while and you don't want to part with it, but you want to jazz it up, I will show you how you can add crystal to your existing chandelier for $20. Since our dining room makeover, I've been transitioning to a more eclectic and shiny accent pieces to the space. I wanted a lighter feel, and I'll have a link down below in case you guys want to see the tour of the dining room and the living room. Now, since the chandelier is the very first thing that people see when you enter our dining room, I still wanted it to be a showstopper, and I felt like it needed a little sparkle, but I didn't want to waste money buying a new one because this one is perfect. It's perfect condition, it's the perfect size and shape, so replacing it just wasn't an option. I just needed a little more embellishing. All you need are the basic supplies and one afternoon. You will need acrylic garland, crystal chandelier teardrops, and ear wire mix. It's just a mixture of earrings and hooks and I will have a link down below to everything you see here. The crystal garland comes in three six feet long strands and it was around $12. You can get 20 teardrop crystals for around $9 to $12, even higher depending on the quantity, size, shape, and the manufacturer you purchase them from. On one end of the garland, there's a hook. I'm placing the hook at the very top of the accent piece on my chandelier. And then I repeated the process with the other two garlands. You can use needle nose pliers to secure it a little more if you need to. On the other end of the garland, there's a jump ring. You're going to open it like I'm doing and place it on one of the arms. I have it on the shortest arms to give it that drape effect. And you want to repeat the process on the other arms as well. Take your teardrop crystals and attach them to the longest ear wire on the jump ring. On my chandelier, there are grooves to make it easier to place them in between the light shade. Depending on how blingy you want your chandelier to be, you can add more crystal teardrops onto the garland. Now my chandelier matches all of my decor accent pieces a lot better. And the best thing about this is if you get tired of the crystals, you can just remove them because they're not permanent. I hope you all have enjoyed this quick and easy DIY. Let me know down below what you think. And I want to thank you all for watching.